to our Catrix 3 training video. Welcome to our Catrix 3 training video. With this video, we will teach you how to complete a basic setup for cataract surgery using the Ertley Catrix 3. Select the on-off switch situated at the back of the machine to power on. If the startup function has been completed successfully, the system ready message will be displayed. From the startup screen, select the desired surgeon from the memory using the plus and minus keys on the upper right hand side of the display panel. Select FACO using the function key on the display panel. Get the handpiece and cassette components ready for setup. FACO tip and accessories IA cassette with tubing, FACO handpiece. First, remove the protection caps from the infusion port and admin set. Connect the admin set to the infusion port of the Catrix cassette. Secure the drainage tube from the cassette to the drainage bag or bottle. Loop the tubing as follows. Insert the locking mechanism into the first holding mount. Right hand holds the cassette and left hand makes a loop with the aspiration line. Using your hand, grasp the second locking mechanism and gently pull the tubing over the pump wheel and secure into the second holding mount. Now connect the cassette. Ensure that the guide pin on the back of the cassette lines up with a port on the cassette slot. Holding the cassette at a 45 degree angle, clip the cassette into the locking pins located on the cassette slot. Press the cassette flush against the device. With a downwards motion, rotating clockwise, clip the cassette into position. Both the left and right locking mechanisms on the drainage tube should be safely in their holding mounts. The infusion line, the short line located directly under the cassette, can now be positioned by slightly pulling the tube to the left towards the irrigation valve. Once the tubing is in the correct position, the irrigation valve will activate, clamping the tube. Hang the drainage bag by securing it on the drainage holder. Ensure the clamp is open when the device is in use. Connect the admin set to the BSS bottle. Fill the chamber halfway with BSS by squeezing. Connect the FACO handpiece to the Ertley device. The FACO handpiece has a blue ring that matches a blue ring on the machine. The arrows must be visible once connected. Connect the irrigation and aspiration lines to the ports on the FACO handpiece. Make sure that the connections are secure. Turn the tip gently in a clockwise direction until it locks into position. Remove the pre-fitted key by pulling in a straight line. Place the sleeve over the FACO tip. Get the sleeve orientation correct by adjusting the irrigation sleeve until the tip of the sleeve borders on the angle of the FACO tip. Secure the test chamber over the irrigation sleeve. The irrigation sleeve must come up to the bevel of the tip. Pull the test chamber over the tip and sleeve until the back end is flush with the irrigation sleeve. Place the handpiece at a 45 degree angle to ensure optimal priming. Press the pre-op button to start the priming cycle. 
allow the pre-op cycle to complete fully approximately one minute. The FACO test will start automatically after a complete pre-op cycle. Allow the machine to run through the cycle up to 100%. The device is now ready for surgery. Please remember that this is a basic guide for setup. Refer to the early user manual for complete instructions. Thank you.